Hey, blessings, and welcome back to another piano tutorial by Moshiwa Music. Today's video, we're going to take a look at major chords, or major seven, major nine, uh, as used in soul and neo-soul chords. Uh, before we get started, I would ask that if it's your first time on the channel, that you hit that subscribe button. If it's not your first time and you've not subscribed yet, today's your opportunity. You also want to hit the bell, the notifications icon. These actions allow us to keep you informed when we upload new videos and get this information out to as many people as possible. All right, so we're going to just take a look at uh, major soul chords, major neo soul chords. And uh, for this demonstration, we'll be primarily looking at the major nine. D flat major nine root position, G flat major nine root position, A flat major nine. All right, so we may not be playing these in a root position. And uh, for those who don't do not know, um, just briefly go over this because this is more of a beginner's type chord. Um, be Beginners type tutorial. So the way we form a major nine is like you say we're just gonna use the key of C to show this. C so be the one, D two, E three, F four, G five, A six, B seven, D. I mean C will be the eight. We're one again eight. D is the nine. I'm going to stop there. And so the way we form a major nine is we take a major triad, add the seven, and the, and the nine as well. And so that's what we're doing. We're playing major nines, starting with this B flat. Where we voicing this is B flat F, A, C. F up there as well. And it's D flat major nine, the way we're voicing this in root position D flat, F, A flat, C, E flat. G flat major nine, the way we voicing this is G flat, you can do G flat, D flat in your left hand, right hand you got F, A flat, B flat, D flat. And it's A flat major nine. A flat, B flat in the left hand, G, B flat, C, E flat in the right. take those chords and, and we're just playing the one type of chord giving this a nice soulful sound and so this is how we are creating progressions and so all we need to do we take these like it's like our foundation we just create little melodies and just little you know build off of that and this just to get you started
did something a little different at the top the second time just just to create you know like a little melody or something so the first pass we have I'm rolling these chords and, and I'm creating a melody, so I'm going rolling from the C to this D to this F. Rolling A flat, uh, A flat, B flat. D flat going from this B flat to the C and my second pass instead of going straight here I'm doing something like D E flat F over this B flat and F D flat, A flat in the left hand, C, F, B flat in the right gives me a D flat 13. Rolling this B flat to this A flat. Alright, and so next chord, left hand is going to that G flat chord, or G flat, you know. G flat, uh, B flat, G flat, but I'm in the left, in the right hand, I'm rolling from this E flat to this F, up to this A flat, and then I'm playing this, uh, it's an A flat six chord or A flat thirteen. So in the left hand you can do A flat and E flat. Right hand you can do C, E flat, and F. Makes it an A flat six. You add that G in the left hand, it makes it A flat thirteen. Excuse the mistakes. I hope that helps. Like the video if you like it. Don't forget to subscribe. Leave a comment in the comment section. Remember, continue to play. Continue to pray. Blessings.